The stage was set. Two basketball titans ready to collide. Serbia, the USA. This wasn't just another game. This was a battle for global supremacy. Serbia, with their crafty, team-oriented play, aimed to dethrone the reigning kings. Team USA, stacked with NBA stars, sought to assert their dominance. The world watched, eager to witness basketball history. Bogdan Bogdanovic, Serbia's sharpshooter, prepared to lead his team. His eyes burned with determination. Across the court, Team USA's Kevin Durant, a scoring machine, exuded confidence. The atmosphere crackled with anticipation. This was a matchup for the ages. Both teams had a lot to prove. Serbia wanted to show the world they were more than just a tough opponent. The USA needed to remind everyone why they were still the team to beat. The pressure was on. As the buzzer sounded, signaling the start of the game, one thing was clear. Neither team was backing down. The roar of the crowd was deafening. Fans from both sides filled the arena, their cheers echoing through the rafters. Serbian flags waved proudly, a sea of red, blue, and white. American chants of USA, USA reverberated through the stadium. The energy was palpable. Every bounce of the ball, every squeak of sneakers on the hardwood seemed amplified. The world held its breath, waiting for the first basket, the first lead change, the first sign of dominance. Cameras flashed, capturing every moment. Commentators spoke with hushed excitement, knowing they were witnessing something special. As the players took the court, the noise reached a fever pitch. It was time for Serbia and the USA to write another chapter in their storied rivalry. The first half was a back-and-forth affair. Serbia, playing with precision and grit, refused to back down. Bogdanovic was on fire, his shots finding the bottom of the net with ease. He was a man possessed, determined to lead his team to victory. Team USA, however, answered the call. Durant, with his smooth moves and deadly accuracy, kept the Americans in the game. He was unstoppable, a force of nature on the court. The lead changed hands multiple times, each possession a battle. The Serbian fans erupted with every basket, their cheers shaking the arena. The American faithful responded in kind, their voices rising in a crescendo of support. As the first half clock wound down, it was clear this game was far from over. The stage was set for an epic second half. The second half began with a renewed sense of urgency. Team USA, their pride slightly bruised, came out firing on all cylinders. They tightened up their defense, forcing Serbia into tough shots and turnovers. The Americans were relentless, their energy and athleticism on full display. Jason Tatum, a rising star in the NBA, took charge for Team USA. His scoring prowess and defensive intensity ignited the American offense. Durant continued his dominance, his presence on the court a constant threat. Team USA was starting to pull away. Serbia, however, refused to go down without a fight. They battled for every loose ball, every rebound, every possession. Bogdanovic continued to be a thorn in the side of Team USA, his shooting touch still deadly accurate. Serbia, despite facing a deficit, continued to play with heart and determination. The final minutes of the game promised to be a nail-biting affair. Bogdanovic was the heart and soul of the Serbian team. His skill set was on full display, a mix of deadly shooting, crafty ball handling, and a basketball IQ that could rival the best. He was everywhere on the court, orchestrating the offense, finding open teammates, and knocking down shots when it mattered most. He was a leader, inspiring his team with his never-give-up attitude. Even when facing a double team, he remained calm and collected, making the right play time and time again. He was a one-man highlight reel, showcasing the beauty and finesse of European basketball. His performance was a testament to his dedication to the game. The crowd chanted his name, recognizing his brilliance and acknowledging his warrior spirit. He was a joy to watch, a true artist on the court, and a formidable opponent for any team. The clock ticked down, the tension mounting with every passing second. Team USA, clinging to a slim lead, seemed to have the game in hand, but Serbia, fueled by Bogdanovic's brilliance and the roar of their fans, refused to quit. A controversial foul call against Serbia sent Team USA to the free-throw line, where they extended their lead. 
Serbian players and fans protested vehemently, but the call stood. The momentum had shifted, and Team USA seemed poised to escape with a hard-fought victory. But Bogdanovic, as he had done all game, had other plans. With ice in his veins, he drilled a clutch three-pointer, silencing the American crowd and bringing Serbia within striking distance. The final seconds were a blur of frantic action. In the end, Team USA held on for a narrow victory, but not without a valiant effort from a determined Serbian squad. The final buzzer sounded, signaling the end of a thrilling encounter. Team USA had emerged victorious, their reign atop the basketball world still intact. But Serbia, through their grit, determination, and the brilliance of Bogdan Bogdanovic, had earned the respect of their opponents and fans worldwide. The game was a reminder that basketball is a global game, with talent and passion found in every corner of the world. It was a showcase of skill, athleticism, and sportsmanship, a testament to the unifying power of sport. As both teams looked ahead, lessons were learned, and new challenges awaited. Team USA, though victorious, knew they had been tested, their vulnerabilities exposed. Serbia, on the other hand, left the court with their heads held high, knowing they had the potential to compete with the best. The future of international basketball was bright, filled with exciting matchups and the promise of even greater competition. The Serbia vs. USA game was just a taste of what was to come, a glimpse into a future where basketball's global dominance continued to grow.